Hello there, welcome back to another new video. My boy, Mr. Talented Reed. And today's video, I have a 2008 Volkswagen Jetter. So, what is happening? It's leaking oil from the oil pressure sensor. So, it caused all the motor to be the oil. Each time they change oil on it, it keeps leaking out all the oil. And they haven't complained that they know where it's coming from. So, when I do some check on it, I realize that it's leaking from that um, sensor right there. That's the oil pressure sensor up there. It's a bit blurry guys but it is right there that black sensor let's see if I can shine the light so I can see it a little better okay see so you see that also when I remove it I just have to show you guys what it look like so it is right up above the oil filter right here so this is the oil filter and it's above it up here guys so what I have to do I have to go to the auto zone store and purchase a, a wrench so this is a 15-16 wrench. I have to cut it with an angle grinder. With a cut in this, so I cut this wrench. Short. This piece having a little problem to to pull it up there based on the space. So I'm going to show you. I use this piece to remove it, guys. So I just have to try and reach in this hole right here. Oh, this will be difficult. Hold on, guys. Okay guys, so I'm going to use this piece of wrench. So the one is open hand. I'm trying to get it loose guys. It's not all that clear to see up there, but it is right there guys. So at least you have a high there how to get it loose when you are changing ears. Try and get it on there. So you have to just twist and turn a little because the space really limited around here. Okay, so now I get it loose. As you can see, I use this open end, guys, and the best to set it this way. As you can see, it have a bend. So you set it upward just like this, guys, and it will work for you. I'm gonna remove the sensor now. I know this video will help to a lot of you guys out there just trying to remove your own um, sensor oil pressure sensor so this video is very useful so I'm asking you guys to please like, share, comment and subscribe and let me know what your thought in the comment section so this is it right here guys so it's leaking right there so I'm going to replace with a new one from AutoZone alright so I guess this is a new one right here let's see ok this is a new one so there are some numbers on it oh my god I think I was in the video sorry about that guys alright some numbers right there from AutoZone guys Okay, so this is it. But this one, this one seems a bit um, smaller, guys. Wow, this one a bit different. Oh my god! Oh, so this one of the two pins, and this one of the single pins. So I'm gonna have to get the correct one, guys, and do over this video. Oh my god, guys! So stay tuned for the other part of the video, guys okay guys welcome back so now i got the correct sensor for the car as i see in the video early on that um sensor was wrong so they sent me the right one now the correct one so let's confirm guys okay so as you can see here the correct sensor two pins okay so i'm going to install it now but guys Okay, as you can see early on guys, it's not that easy to um, access with that wrench. So I'm just going to try my best guys to get it in. Okay, 
It's a bit tricky to catch in there, but yes. Okay, there you go. Okay, so I'm gonna try and see if I can lock it back in place. Okay, so this wrench I cut it about um five to six inches at best. I didn't measure it guys but it's not that long. Because of this funny right here and the space up there, but easy to catch. Okay. All right. So I get it to lock right there, guys. it right here guys you can see it about six inches all right guys so I have to spot the wire and plug it on guys oh dang okay all right so now I get it on there and that's it guys so that's where you change your oil pressure sensor uh, 2008 Volkswagen Jetta so what I'm gonna do now get some degrees and clean off this area so it doesn't clean alright so I even do the oil change on it so that's it for now guys so if you find this video useful please like share comment and subscribe to my youtube channel Thank you all for watching. Catch me another time. Bye.